uh, marinated in. Garlic, ginger, a bit of some soy sauce inside, salt and pepper, you know, and uh, that's it. You want to go really simple on this fillet steak when you uh, marinate it overnight. It's going to be nice and tender and really beautiful. All right. And it doesn't take very long to cook, I understand, because um, it's a, the fillet. Yes, once it's already marinated, number one, fillet doesn't take any time to cook at all. But once it's marinated, you're just going to flip it up in like a minute and it's going to be really cooked. So it's going to be a minute steak. Okay. All right. Great. So I guess let's move it. We just want the pan to be hot. We have a poaching pan as well here. So I think let's just put it on as well so we can poach the pan. So what's going to go in the egg, Benedict? It's going to be the egg, the, um, the egg, the poached egg, the beef, and some spinach that we're going to saute. Oh, okay. So I'm here for the spinach. Yeah, great. So we're gonna See, health, health, yeah, vegetables. Health. Very important, by the way. It's 2017. We're supposed to be healthy. But, you know, here we are making some uh, clarified... Making pan. butter. <laughs> <laughs> Into a sauce. <laughs> so the pan getting nice and hot there yeah. for the beef. So we're just going to take the beef and we're just going to pan sear it. This, yeah. Just want to pan fry it for a couple of minutes until it's nice and cooked. At the same time, let's just put this aside. So we have the poaching pan also getting warmed up here. And then, uh, yeah, it's already warmed up. So we already have the water underneath here, right? Yes. Okay, good, fantastic. So do you want to put a bit of some water in here? Some butter. Oh, we'll put some butter. Okay. Yes. Yes. Some butter. Okay, how about some vinegar? Just a half a spoon. Okay. Yes. You guys put butter and everything today. I know, that's the thing, you know, so do, do, do you want us to go with a bit of some oil? But but it brings a very beautiful taste, you know, so that's fine. You know, go to the water is boiling. Yep, the water is boiling. So we have basically, it's more of like a bain, bain marie. So bain marie is basically a hot water bath. So, so the water is underneath here? Yeah, the water is underneath. The water is, uh, the water is underneath, so it's like, you know, heating it up. Mm. So look at that, really good. So I'm just going to take oh. it there. I'm just coating the... Yeah, I'm just coating, just a little bit. Just a little bit, so it doesn't stick. In the meantime, look at that steak. Yeah, the steak is cooking really well. It's going to be delicious. Great, so we're going to take an egg and just going to place it in the middle there. Then it's going to poach. There we go. So how many minutes, Chef, is it going to cook? Like It'll just take five minutes. All right, so five minutes to cook. For poaching and the eggs. Wait. Five minutes. Wait. Five minutes poaching egg, but you need to cover it so that it steams up really well, right? What if what if we don't have one of these pans at home, these poaching pans? What, what how can else can we poach an egg? What I would say is that the easiest way to basically poach an egg at home would be like directly in hot water. So you want the water to boil up really fast because this is a bit really fancy. Just cover it up. So you just want the water to uh, become really hot, and then we're just gonna break an egg in the middle. And you need to get the egg that's gonna be really really fresh. You know, the fresher the egg, the intact it gets together. But you come in casa na egg dogo na no mabemu nyedu kana takaele amba iko fresh imezaliwa jana. Isn't there a way to, to measure the freshness of the egg? Like put them in water, see if they float or something exactly, like that? Exactly, definitely. You know, when it basically floats, this means it's a good egg. When it sinks, it's basically it's aged. It's like quite some time. So a fresh egg really makes sense. Let's see what's happening over on here. They're almost ready. Fantastic. Yes. Really nice. So we just put it on a plate. Let's just put the minute steak on a plate. It's really nice. It's basically filler steak. It looks really nice and juicy. Awesome. Yeah. Nice. So what I'm going to do, oh, you're going to get a bit of some heat. <laughs> Great, so let's use the same pan yes. to uh, saute a bit of some bread, like, you know, let's, the muffins. So we call these, like, basically bread rolls or rather muffins, so we just want to slice them. Yeah, please, chef, thank you very much. So I just want to slice them, and then I'm going to, I'm just going to pan fry them to pale to get the flavors from the beef as well, so that's fine. You want them to be a bit hot, and then we're going to use the same pan as well to saute our... Uh, Spinach. Oh. oh, do we have another pan as well? But yeah. it's fine, you know, I like I like the flavors. I like the flavors that yeah. we're going to get in, like, you know, from the uh, from the beef and all to make it even more flavorful. Ha the spinach has been cooked already or, yes. or boiled or blanched yeah. or something? Uh, par cooked, yeah. So partly cooked or rather blanched as well. So we're just going to saute with a bit of some garlic and ginger. And I'm in for the same pan, you know, why not? You get the flavors from everywhere and save those pans at home. You don't have to wash dishes yeah, every two minutes. Exactly. <laughs> I know you like that. <laughs> <laughs> Great, look at that. Really nice. So at the same time, I'm going to use the same, same pan. I'm going to saute a bit of some garlic and ginger. Okay. Yeah, a bit of some garlic. Garlic. That pan is really hot. Yeah, the pan is really hot. So uh, just reduce a bit. Yep. Garlic, ginger. A bit of some onions until they're nice and golden color. 
A bit of some ginger. Wait, so you want to give them some flambe? Let's take a flambe, kidogo. Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yes, that's what we're talking. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. Yeah. Really good. So this yes, one, you just want to go in with your... Um, Our spinach. The spinach. Inside. Yeah. Great. So if you have cream here, you can always go in with the cream. It's always, you know... Yeah, creamed spinach is always delicious. Delicious, exactly, right? So, yep. So unfortunately today I don't think we have cream, right? We don't have cream. That's okay. So that is fine. Yes. Wait, just spit it up. It's really good. Come How are our eggs doing? Our eggs are doing really well. Look at that. Beautiful. So it's like the handle. They said it's five minutes here. Yep. Almost five minutes. So we're at we three. Yeah. We still have one minute more Great. for the poached eggs. So okay. In a bit so that we'll just turn it up. And the good thing is that we just remove this and turn it on top of it, right? Fantastic. Now let's let's make our egg Benedict. Wait, let's do that. Let me just move this. And then we start. Uh, let me just clean up our place. You know, it's supposed to be clean as you go. Fantastic. Awesome. There, here I am. Great. I'm gonna do for the egg Benedict. I have that, and I have that. Wait. What's gonna go underneath would basically be some cheese. Yep, some cheddar. <laughs> <laughs> I hope Willis Raburu is eating this well on his honeymoon. I know, you know, he needs to, oh, his brother has to ask for it. You think he's going to come back having gained weight or lost weight? <laughs> I think he'll gain a lot of weight. My God, there's no detox. Hopefully. Up on Kukula. It's all about eating, right? Yeah. Fantastic. So, what's going to happen here? The way it is, I'm just going to take a slice of the mini steak. Look at that. Beautiful. So juicy. Yeah, really nice. I'm just going to tear it into two. I'm going to take that and I'm going to place it there. And I'm going to place it Come on, like Jesus. Mini, yes. Yeah, like mini, 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 mini egg benedict, but it's going to be really delicious. I'm going to do, I'm just going to take some spinach. You know, with all the butter we've used today, I think it's okay because the portion size at the end of the day is really small, yeah. so I don't feel too guilty. Yeah, exactly. So, uh, look at that. Just going to do a bit of some spinach, really hot spinach. They're happening. I'm going to do the same as well. Great. That's really good. That looks amazing. The eggs should be uh, just about ready yeah, by now. It's going to be almost ready, so we'll probably just remove the egg. Um, uh, chef, let me just get a plate, please. And then uh, so I can be able to, like, you know, just turn it on top. Exactly, on it. Great, thank you. So the portions are really tiny, but at the end of the day... I'm happy with that. <laughs> <laughs> and we still have the, the hollandaise sauce. Yeah, we still have the hollandaise is going to go on top. Okay. Like on top of the egg. This is basically the garnish. Or uh, the cherry on the cake. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get those eggs out. Let's get the eggs popping. Look at that. Look at that. It's so easy to remove the eggs. Like, can we remove that? Yeah, we can. But you want to hold it with a bit of some... Uh, great. So it's hot. It on top of this is our poached egg, then we put it direct to. Just, yes. You know, sometimes with egg benedict, you want the yolk to kind of drip, you know? You want the yolk to drip. Great. Yep, 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 yep. So the more the yolk drips, the better the egg benedict is. Look at that. That's how it's supposed to be, you know? It's supposed to be drippy. Let's put the other one there as well. It's supposed to be drippy and. Uh, um, half cooked. Oh, okay. That's basically, the whole idea. Yeah. And uh, as I said, with eggs, you can just drink them as well. You know, <laughs> that's even better. Raw. Great, raw egg. But this is fine. It's not raw. It's like you know, partly cooked but healthy. So the bread in the into a drip. Yes, 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 yes. That's what we're talking about. That's what we're talking about. And then we're just gonna drip some hollandaise sauce to make it even more beautiful. And here you just want to go a bit too close up so you can get this lovely uh, shot. Wow. <laughs> egg on butter on egg. <laughs> exactly. You know? Yeah, that looks amazing though. It's delicious. So I know, you know what? Someone needs to dig into this. Someone needs to do a little tasting. It's breakfast and, you know. <laughs> and that's going to be you. That's going to be Chef Ali. I can't, how do you eat this? You, do you need a fork and knife? Uh, probably, I'm yeah. too. probably, yes, you need a fork and knife. But I just want it to cool up a bit so that I can be able to... D do you have a minute to eat this thing? Probably. We do. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Oh, my God. I'm just going to go deep into this. Oh, my God. The Here it is. is. Too tiny for me, but probably... You should be able to come to me and go to me and come to me and I will eat it. 
moto tuje na naweza hiyo 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 nimbeni nyimbo basi kidogo nimbeni nyimbo kidogo ni moto ndo maana sasa kiweka maneno let me go pole 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 1 2 3 kija hii sawa tutafika break eh oh my god <laughs> okay, I did not know that was going to happen. I thought there was a bite happening, but he just went in. <laughs> This is for you, Willis. We're representing you today. <laughs> he can't talk, but um it, it was good. <laughs> All right. So, <laughs> we'll be back of course with more uh, with Chef Ali and uh, Chef William. Here is your Van Gogh Hills Hotel. These are some lovely breakfast tips that you can prepare at home. Steak eggs benedict with hollandaise sauce and spinach. Uh, you know, a lovely nice small portion. <laughs> It's still can't talk. Our breakfast does continue though. Our Fred and Dimuli still uh, with his news review panel and like I said, we'll be back with more. Is a whole egg benedict in your mouth. Fantastic. Let's take a quick break. We'll be back. <laughs>